Hey everyone, welcome to episode 8 of Let's Play Cars, Disney Pixar Cars, Mary National. In the last episode, we did some. We, 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 we did some uh, mini games. Uh, we played the last. the first two levels of. American Slice Last Laugh, which you're supposed to do those two first. If you want to, hey, we did some two new mini games, which are all good. Which those two are called Try to Tip In and I find it Ghosting Ghosty Mater, which that's supposed to be like a a reference. Um, that mini game is supposed to be a reference to In the Ghost Light. Oh, and then we also did the second same race, which that one was a little more difficult than the first one, but we won luckily. In this episode, we'll be doing the first few main road races in the third and final area of the game, which is called Delta Pass. Oh, and also we got our upgrade boost. It's been upgraded again. Alright. Yeah, that's all I'm going to take this time. They boost a lot faster now. Right there is, is how you get to Telford Pass, and here's the lens screen for it. And here's the cutscene for this one. This is a little shorter than the other two. There one. Then we got to Burnt Valley. Like there's a new guy in town. Yep. And yeah, that that first car we saw there in the cut in that cutscene. That is yeah, that's actually the next boss character of the game. We'll see who that character is and later in this episode. For now, what are we gonna do the next one? Oh hey, we an achievement. For Lock and Telford Pass. I believe Arm Valley and Lock Telford Pass. Yeah, we got Seven achievements in lobby, almost half of them. Alright. And yeah, we're like halfway to two million points. Crazy, huh? Alright. Yeah, here's the first one. Before we, before we start it. Hey, Fillmore. Let me do the next. The next red race, which is called Little Circuit. No. I think I'm, I want to say that these red races are actually the hardest ones. Yeah, these ones are kind of tricky. Well, this one's not as tricky, but the other two, yeah, they're kind of they're kind of tricky and hard. All right. Here, opponents are Fletcher. <laughs> Uh, Lenny, Ramon, and um, let me see. I can't read who that. It's one of the two. And Tia. Let me see if I can get a close look. I think it's Tia because I think it says I think I see it's E in the beginning of it. All right. Yep. Here it is. It's kind of sim. It's kind of similar to. It's kind of similar to um, Delta Pass Circuit and Delta Point Road Hazards back in the first game. Okay, how am I? Why am I slowing down? Okay, that was just weird. Anyways, um, whoa. Anyways, we got that. As you can see, here's the the tunnel. Yeah, it's the yeah um, the tunnel. There's a tunnel in the Temple Pass Circuit area. That's pretty. That's a bit different. The, the change is a shortcut, by the way. Whoa. Yeah. There's. Luigi 
Luigi's Tire Tire Store and Ramon's Body of Art Store. They're in there. They're at there for some strange reason. And um, well, it's the last area, so yeah. Kind of. It's the, last, it's the last area, so I mean, it's probably the last time I'll have to see that. Luigi's Tires store and Ramon's store in a different area. Besides, we're actually getting kind of close to the end of the game. Yeah, not kidding. We're, we're, it's, the final, it's the final location. I mean, we should be at the I mean, we should be at towards the end of the game. Yeah, see, like I said, this is a, this is a pretty short game. This one's a bit shorter than the first one is. So, probably less than 15 episodes should take to complete this walkthrough. Alright, anyways, on the final lap. And this one's like a minute 20 seconds at least to finish the lap here. Slow down. I think you slow down when you take this path. That must be why I'm. I don't know why I'm going, but I might be why I'm going pretty slow. Just kind of weird. Okay, the first two seconds ahead. I'm gonna take the main path just to show you what that looks like. For some of you people who never played this game before. Alright. So, yeah, you just don't. Okay, well, I think boosting kind of makes that get up there easily. Alright, here's the finish line. That one was 10 seconds longer than lap 2. But whatever I won. We didn't... Oh, okay, I was wrong. It's me. Yeah, okay. And wow, Fletcher got kind of far behind from Lenny. Alright. And there we go. We went, we went 12 bolt bangers for that. See, for that, I'm not saving the game. Because, um, just want to. That's just in case if uh, something goes wrong with the recording. Alright, after playing that, you know, I could be wrong, but I think it lets you... Okay, yeah, let's do the, let's do the team relay next. That's pretty easy to do that. It's been a little while since we last did the last episode. Open the week or so. Okay, that's the next red race, but we're not doing it yet. What are we doing? The we're doing the next red race. Just right over here. I'm sorry. Team relay. Okay, yep, and yep, that's the third one, and it's at the one we just did, and and this is the second to last team relay in the game, so the last one is let's not spoil it because I don't think it'll be spoiled if I tell you what the, the last one is. And well it's, well yeah. Team relay is like the fourth and final one's like really towards the end, end of the game. Alright, here five. We're playing this one. Oh hey we got Otto with us. Team Otto and Team Fletcher is our two team opponents for this team relay. Alright, here we are. Okay, I can barely hear Otto. Hello. 
Set the game or something because I don't think I struggle that this often. And on me and difficulty. Okay, anyways, our second character's dial cuts and just like in the first one. Okay, yeah. Okay, it's kind of similar to the same card from the first team, really, except this time it replaces Mayor with Fillmore. Just to make it a little different. And the second two cars for the other two teams are Vince and Gerald. Whoa, okay. They kind of got a little bit of lead. And we just switch to, change to that headset. First time being as him in this in this game. Who's also another one of these default unlock characters. Uh, well actually I think most of the characters are default unlocked. Yeah, there's not that many characters that's unlocked that's locked. There's like five I think. Anyways our third and the other two third and final characters are are uh, Barry and Yuri. Yuri. How, why am I going to send him miles per hour? That's strange. I don't think I would go this slow. There, those trees actually. Into the finish line. No surprise to me, man. Yeah, probably. <laughs> okay, wow, we're nearly kind of ahead of uh, Team Auto and Fletcher. And, and here we go. 50,000 points for breaker bonus. Alright. Yep. Yep, I sure can't miss it. Alright, there we go, that is done with the third Team Relay. So yeah, the Team Relay, now the Team Relay is starting to get a little more, a little more difficult. Okay, let's see, okay, we can't, can't transport. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Okay, I transport there because it's going to take me a while to get out of that area. A little shortcut area, I explained. I think I explained. Um, there's no other way out except the way you get through it. Okay. I just want to transport. Yeah, if you go to one of your, if you go to an event that's already been um, completed, press Y to transport that that spot. 
Anyways, it's time for the second Telephone Pass Red Race, which is called the Upper Mine. Very interesting one. Is that, a, is that an area that you cannot go to access to? Um, okay, I'm guessing Tia is who that is. Here we go. Also got Barry, Snotrod, and Vince. Crash to a mine cart. They slow you down and hold on a second. Okay, start with the interruption. And he's back to the game. And oh my goodness, everyone is catching up to me. Okay. Those reasons are you're starting to get a little intense or interesting. Because. Because I'm um, crashing to a lot of things. Well, kind okay, of not really. And of course, they'll take the shortcut. The reason why I didn't take it because I want to take the main path just to show you what that looks like. I forgot my boost is going. Is 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 Tia that far ahead of me? Oh, there, okay, there she is. People who never played this game before. Alright. Okay, here. Yeah, there's minecarts in these little tunnels. Those tunnels kinda kinda reminds me of the the, the big tunnel for the mountain in uh in, in the in the original cars game. And there there is their difference. There's little there's mine tracks, but there's no minecarts to avoid. Two minutes, wow. Okay. The best way to avoid the minecarts is just to stay off the railway tracks and ah oh, dang I just hit one. Oh no. So yeah, so yeah, this is kinda one of the hardest this is kinda one of the harder race tracks on here. Alright. I'll just take the shortcut to Tia, because I think it's best to do that. Okay. Jump over the holes. Ooh. Nearly, nearly jump over that one. Okay, and left free, I'll just kind of show you what happens if you don't jump. You don't, you don't, um, you don't die or anything. Probably the racetrack or anything. You just, it's another path you can, you can take. I'm not sure it's faster or not. But I'll just use it. Anyways, there's another shortcut. I think this is the last shortcut in this racetrack. Yeah. I'll know. Come on, quit crashing to my carts. years ago, I watched a YouTuber named Zero Postal Forever, and when he was doing this racetrack in, the, in this in, in this this game in his walkthrough, um, there was a glitch that he found. The, the minecarts are like invisible all of a sudden. I don't know how he did it, but that's what happened. The, the minecarts were invisible for some strange reason. Which is weird. Okay, there we go. I did a I'm doing a little better this time. In the last two laps, because I didn't hit any of my cards. I'm still not as like that far ahead, but I'm just like four seconds. I'll get back, kinda slow me down a bit. And I'll also get even more if I just keep slowing down all of a sudden. And I'll just don't jump this time. 
to show you what the path looks like. Yeah, so you fall down and go in this little tunnel. Don't worry, there's no there's no there's no rails or anything like that, so don't worry about trying to avoid mine carts. Yeah, I'm not sure that's faster or slower. Than jumping over the deer path, just jumping over the poles. Okay. Whoa. Oh no, not good. Quick crash into mine carts. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I see what I mean, like what makes the game hard is just like these race tries to get hard and Pucks and shortcuts a little more often than they usually do. Hi, I always be one. <laughs> okay, got a little interesting, but it's alright, we won though. Yep, I was right, I was to you. And, oh dang, Barry was pretty far behind from Snotrod in the other comp. The rest, of the, the rest of the competition. Alright, there we go. We won. And we got another one, and. Alright, and we got, we just got another race done. And that, that means the next one is the very last re race of the game. Believe it or not, guys. Yeah, we got one more race to go. So after this, we are officially done with the main road races of the game. And guess what? Another boss. And this is the second to last boss of the game. And remember earlier in, the, in this episode, we saw a new race char character. So isn't in that cutscene. So isn't that so in the um, loan screen? You are about to be in this in this race, which is actually the hardest one of the of of them all, and the longest one too. Canyon Run. And I'll explain what, how long it, tell you what makes it hard and long after this cutscene. Hey, you're that drift car I saw earlier, right? <laughs> Looks like you were taking those turns sideways. Pretty cool. Hey, you ever heard of this one? Turn right to go left. Right, you said lightning. That's me. And this, this is Mater. Konnichiwa. Konnichiwa. Mater, you speak Japanese? Well, sure, doesn't everybody? Bokuは君の友達の大ファンなんだ。僕の友達もみんな彼のことを知ってるよ。もし僕が彼とレースしたら大興奮するだろうな。人伝説のレースになるよ。彼は僕の挑戦を受けてくれるかな。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。うん。う
You are, you are ready? You are ready for the next game race? Um, yeah. Yeah. So there. So now it's just like. So now it's just kind of telling you you have to complete the breast bucket races to do to do this. So it's kind of best. It's best to do that after you beat the Hornet Valley in the races. All right. Have to take. Um, I'm not sure this is a shortcut. Okay, it's not. It's okay. This is probably a bad path to take. All right, anyways, our punts are Koji Philip. Wow, we haven't seen her since the second main road race in in a Hornet Valley. It's been a while. And we've got Yuri and Gerald. Yeah, yeah, Gerald's racing too. It's kind of weird because Mater, why isn't Mater racing with us in this? Because in the DS version, uh, Mater race gets us in this one. So that's kind of weird. Anyways, um, yeah, this is a really hard racetrack and the longest one in the game too. Because look, it's two laps. Yeah, that's kind of strange. Every single one we did so far was free laps. You know, why is this one too? You might ask. It's because this one's so long that they wanted to do two laps instead of free because they think free is too much. Too long to do. Yeah. So yeah, this, this restrack is pretty huge. Oh, hello, Koji. Oh my goodness, they are. Not going easy on us in this one. They're they're trying to keep up with me. They're trying to keep up with us now. That's why. All right, here's here's this part that's interesting. Get the with the big rocks. How do they slow down immediately like that? That's weird. Anyways, look at this area. Have y'all recognize this area? If we can get there. Yeah. It's this area. From the first game. We decided to put this shortcut wrong way. I was not going the wrong way. Okay, I don't know why. Yeah, y'all know, know this area, so. I don't know why I did the name. I don't know why I did that. This road. It was kind of down. Whoa, how did I caught up to the other two? Okay, we're struggling. Okay, I'm struggling a little bit. I need to get better. I need to get better at this. We've got one lot to go. And this is a long race track. Wow, three minutes. Yeah, three minutes. Yeah, that's definitely that's definitely worth that for two laps. If this is real laps, this this will be like a nine minute race. At least. Gotta slow down a little bit just so. Uh, this could be the shortcut. Yeah. I'm gonna say that this is a shortcut because this way it feels a lot faster. Don't take that other path down there I did I took in the first lap. Because that way is too that way's too long and that road completely down the bit. Alright, anyways. Up. 
Yep, we're catching up, alright. Alright. Let's boost. And let's avoid the rocks. It's hard to tell where they are. Just never know where they fall. Okay, anyways. Uh, ah, screw you. I turn, why don't you take the shortcut? Man, just hoping I'll stay ahead and oh please don't tell me they're catching up. They're ahead of us, aren't they? Okay, they're not. Good. And it's a close finish here. Okay, maybe not really. Up. So I'm this race. Yeah, I win. All right, there we go. Hey, we are in achievement. Win all road races. Won all nine road races, free of each of uh, the free main areas. Yep, we are in achievement for that too. Wow, Muka, that was a little tense race. Man, wow, that's probably one. Oh, Koji came in fourth. I was thinking he'll come in last, but that'd be crazy. Wow, Gerald cannot keep up with this guy. The rest. Min two minutes half is high my best time record here. There we go, we are in 18. Let's look at our progress. We are 90% down with the game. Wow, we're getting really close here. Well, 90% of the story mode, yeah, really. We got 243 bolt banners. We need about... We just need about 107 more bolt banners to go. Wow. Anyways, not saving yet. So let's watch this last cutscene and we'll end off the episode. Well, it'd be two actually. One short one and one long one. Uh, an update for the, the new building. Wow, you burned through your tires pretty quick doing that. You know, you should go see Luigi down at. Oh man, that was crazy. Ow. Mater, that was incredible! Are you okay? Oh yeah, that was fun! Huh? Dollar Joker. Ha! <laughs> that was a funny cutscene. Right there. Welcome back, folks! Mater here. And as you can see around me, the new stadium is just about done. I'm saving up for my season tickets now. <laughs> I might even get me some man box seats. Hey, you're right. on my crew. You get to come here for free. I do? Thanks, buddy. <clears throat> so the main national continues. And we are seeing some very interesting matchups. Well, Koji comes to us from the world of drift racing. Although that seems pretty different from my type of racing, it's actually not. Is that a fact? Now, if I get to come here for free, do I get stuff from the snack bar for free, too? Uh, sure, Mater. Anyway, as I was saying, drift racing is all about style. You gotta have the technical chops, but if you can't make it look good, then you're missing out on half the equation, right? So let me get this straight. Even if there ain't a race going on, I can still come down to the snack bar. Sure. As much as you can haul out of here. Well, all right! <clears throat> Thank you, Lightning McQueen, for coming by and bringing us up to speed on the races. Hey, everybody, I get three stacks at the snack bar. Glad I could help. All right, then. All right, guys. Hey, we're going to end the episode right here. So next time, let's play. Guys, oh, my God, to interrupt me. Anyways, uh... Okay, I forgot to mention, this is what the map looks like. Forgot to mention that in this swap for but here. Here's what the map looks like in Templin Pass. And this is a pretty small area. A anyways, next time, next time let's play Cars Me National. What are we doing? We're going to be finding all the... We're going to find all the paint jobs and tires in Templin Pass. Pass. And we'll should we have all the tires and all the 
and all the paint jobs unlocked for Lime McQueen. So, see you guys later, alligators.